And hey there, it's me, Modelinko. Welcome back to some more on the Ron Sagas. What does it say Fire Emblem for? I know this is t this is technically a Fire Emblem game, but fuck, man. Anyway, last time. I feel like a fucking idiot. Hang on. Yeah, last episode was pretty important. Last time, we beat we beat Skyla. Found out her true nature being a terror, and. Uh, she planned to, planned to do something odd to the babe to Ilanda's baby, which is like probably turn turn him into like some like harbinger of terror or something. I don't know. Ilanda's kind of out of commission for right now, but she's not dead thanks to Helga giving some of her life essence to her. I'm still very confused about that. She kind of felt like an ass pull. Not gonna lie. But I mean, hey, at least I at least Ilanda and Bodymon didn't both die pretty much. So. That's nice. Maybe she'll be back in commission soon. Anyway. Let's do this map. Well, I saw pretty much all the like lame shit in my fucking... In my fucking supplies, so... I have a whole bunch of fucking money now. <laughs> yeah, 111, look at that. All of, so much shit was fucking put in there. You can bear it. The buggy, no. I'm gonna check to see if it, what the reward is for that, but first I'm gonna eat the spirit thing. They'll force it up, bitch. And now I'm gonna check. Well, 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 there's a Mr. Buggy from Boggy. It's been a while since we last chatted. How are you? Oh, Mr. Zimbal, there you are. We're looking for you. Huh? What? You have? Ah, uh, look, I think we got off on the wrong foot. Can we start over from the from the beginning, ma'am? I suppose so. This is well, now why you're after me. There are all kinds of bad deeds in my life. To say the least. Look, I know you hate evildoers. Truth is, so do I. Pardon? This terrible was born and raised in a small village. No, the boy was taken by slavers and forced to steal. They whipped me every day and beat me and tortured me. They did? Mrs. Mullen, just a poor guy who's down on his luck. I know you heard a million sob stories in your career, but the truth is I was wanting to be a good guy. But how could I be? I'm impoverished. I'm all alone. My whole life I've been running from those slavers. I just steal to make ends meet. I became a wicked man. I can't wait for this all the story to be bullshit. I know you must hate me, but can't you open your up your heart? Can't you understand my plight? I'm a victim of the system. I just wish I had the resolve to make myself feel bad. Please, oh my god, please get the skill, please, I won't even care about the bear buggy support, because I'm sure she won't give anything close to this, unless it's death blow. Oh my god, I lose, I'll never amount to anything. Speak not those words. Mm. Resistible. He suffered immensely, but I was too blind to see. How can I judge someone who has lived such a sad life? I was born into the nobility, it's not my right to judge. Buggy, if you want to improve your lot in life, I can help. If I punish a criminal one, I can set you on the good path. And you can leave someday and help other unfor poor unfortunate, other unfortunate souls. That poor unfortunate cell is not fucking. This is not the fucking Little Mermaid. Oh yes, thank you as well. You truly moved my heart. The music has shown me kindness in all my years. Yeah, that we can become agents of justice, helping our listeners. Indeed we can, Buggy. Indeed we can. Report to me tomorrow. We'll begin training. Yes, ma'am. Oh, what a dumb broad. Can't believe she bought that crap. Oh man, now I'm gonna have to do a bunch of boring shit. Bullshit. She's just chilling me like a soldier to reform me or whatever. I need to get out of this dump. Yeah, he gets resolve. Look at you with fucking resolve, baby. I'm actually, you know, I, I have the support bonuses as a thing there. I'm gonna just check for buggy. So. Oh. That guy is... what? Hang on. The fucking chapter one boss can be recruited? 
Huh? Whatever. Barrett gets Forager. That's fucking barely worth it. It's like, oh, I got like renewal on fucking terrain, but resolve, baby. That's what I fucking need. Resolve. Okay, so I definitely missed out on quite a few characters if the fucking first chapter boss can be recruited. God damn. Welcome to the Sir Sir Church Imperium. We are servants of the Fire God. Please accept our hospitality and, and allow us to treat your injuries. We are aware that High Priestess Ash has declared you enemies. However, she does not speak for all of us here in the church. She may be our High Priestess, but her word is not law. Our once pure, only Perion may decree the fate and punishment of the masses. Here, I want you to use this tome. It contains Perion's might within. If he deems you worthy of wielding his power, he said to smite your foes. May the Fire God, fire God blaze a path for you and all your com and all your companions. Holy fire! Yeah, you asshole. Boom! Yes, yeah, the stupid spirit, get out of here. I mean, you guys down here, I guess. I have, uh, no, stealables is nothing really. Yeah. I was, I mean, she doesn't seem that bad of a boss, so uh, I'm surprised there's no meteor tomes. I thought there would be a siege tome or something. Get the fuck out of here, yeah. Bing, bada boom. You got this way. Jack, our enemy is Lady Asher, high ranking fire priestess. We have to take this seriously, she's a terrifying opponent. She seems like any other magic wielder, if you ask me. What's so special about her? Fire priestess appear and possess many mystical powers. They can walk on lava and call fire spirits to fight for them. Most terrifying of all, however, is their ability to call meteors. Okay, so she can use meteor. Meteors? You see her channeling, you need, to, you need to order your men to reach her position. Let her finish her spell and it will be the end of one of your soldiers. She will be at her most vulnerable right before her spell finishes, so strike then. Okay, so... Meteor is a fucking one-hit KO. Okay. Sounds like we need to kill her quickly. But if you're killing her once will not be enough. High priestesses can rise like phoenixes. They will rebirth from death several times. Luckily, priestesses power wanes after each rebirth. Keep striking until she dies. Gotcha, lands through the heart. Stab the broad a bunch of times. You can do that easy piece. Okay, so... Now I understand why... This this map at first seems pretty easy. Nope, I had to do that. Kill her multiple times. Oh, really? I still have y'all. No, I have the javelin equip. I'm stupid. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. Oh, I forgot to equip a fucking javelin, but you're dead. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, ow. I'm getting lucky. Our dragons are on their way. Forgot what voice I even gave you. Okay, these guys have nothing to really steal, yeah. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. It should be speed two luck and defense. Out of here too. Okay, you can visit that house, and then you can yes visit the villages. There's a few villages here. Uh... Kill this one. 
Be able to force it up and then come here. Ooh, a whole bunch of these fucking fire zones. Hell yeah. One, two, three. I think she's good. Thousands of years ago, there was only dragons living in Timaya, and then the Manakis had to take human form for reasons unknown. Then human settlers arrived from Andoran, creating the first fires. Having strong draconic features is a sign of status in Timaya. Reptilian eyes, pointy ears, even scaly skin is seen as having power. Guess, uh... Okay, I can just attack you with you. Bam, I love you. These guys do not move. Okay. Greetings, I'm an envoy from Styxia observing the Civil War. His Highness King Kangox has taken in an interest in the conflict. His son, Prince Darius, is also quite invested in the outcome. For what purpose, I do not know. I'm just here to do my job. Please do not give my position away to these dragons. Okay, so you're gonna be important. And then visit this village. Civil war is broken out in Timaid. Now it is spreading everywhere. Tindaris, the king's chosen heir, faces off against Ilrodan, the king's eldest. Some claim that Tindaris is the rightful ruler as King Bothu picked him. However, others believe our, ki our late king's judgment was lacking in his last days. Tindaris is only a half-blood, you see. Some among the nobility dislike that. As for me, I think we should respect King Bathu's dying wish. Take this axe, it might help you against Ildran's soldiers. Ooh, dragon axe? Hell yeah, more of those. I can visit this one. There's two more after. Ambla! Jahara, this is unexpected. Where do you think you're going? Very far away, before that dimwit ash calls down a meteor upon us all. Why is the church sided with Ildran? We have not sided with anyone, at least not publicly. Just admit the truth, we know your stance. The church should not take a side. Uh, Adrian promised me a promotion. He intends for Ash to die here. I don't like that airhead, but I don't like Adrian either. Fortunately, he is taking total control of Lord Pyrian's word. Who priestesses have no choice but to go along with his demands. If you don't like Adrian, why, then why fight for him? But you should join me, help me restore Tendaris to... If I refuse, I want what is best for Team Maya Jahara. Illidan is a slimy worm, yes, but he's a true dragon spawn. Tendaris is a halfer. He will lead Timaya down a path of ruin. You know that's not true. Agent's methods are forceful, but I, be but I believe in Elrodon. Only a true-blooded Drake can bring stability to Timaya. Timaya. Even if it means destroying Lord Perian's divine legacy. Perian's following will persevere. We're not as weak as you think. Hmm. Here, take this. When, we ne when next we meet, there will be his enemies in battle. May, may the one true king win this war. Or well, I'm blood. May the one true king endure. Nice Oratone there. So I got two villages and then just a few houses left. Nice glaciers. Here, and give me the power to smite my foes from afar. Call upon your mightiest blessing, a fiery meteor. Oh, fuck me. Watch out, Ash is channel channel channeling a spell. Fuck, you can't reach. Um. No, you still don't have the meteor in your... Is it gonna show in your... I don't think so, but... Oh, you don't one-shot. Damn. Of course, you don't one-shot this guy. Skill and defense. There you go. That's how you fucking get levels right now. Ah, fuck. Um. Uh, 
I don't want my boy to die there, so, uh... Put you here, I guess. Angelus is still gonna fucking die, though, isn't he? I'm running out of fucking money. Okay, I think this is good. Really, I need the fucking trainer. Goddamn staff rank more. Okay, well, all of them are fucking attacking you, Jahara. HP skill speed, nice. So. She doesn't fucking summon a meteor without it going in her inventory. I'm pretty sure they're gonna do that. Now cheat. Get out of here. Imperion has answered my prayers. Fire shall rain from the skies. Oh god. Everyone, sorry, strike at the priestess. She's about to summon a meteor. Okay, now she's gonna summon. Okay. Next turn she's gonna summon. Okay. Scared for a second. Okay, let's see how much. Eight, oh, okay, yeah, that will definitely kill me. 3 to 15? Goddamn. HP. String skill. Look. My boy. My boy. Okay, who can... Uh, you can probably kill the best. Yeah. Here on fire. Rain down your fiery punishment upon the, uh, on this heretic. I'll get it. Fear will kindle my dying embers. Shoot magic speed and res. Well, I mean, you capped out res now. Nice. This is only speed you need to cap out. And then the rest you, you'll definitely never cap out. Okay, so now there's just the house there. Oh, nice base level up cap skill too. I feel I think it was not the big meanie and a thug. He always looked so angry and upset. I think if he had a nice man to keep wife to marry, he wouldn't be so unhappy. Oh, if we could take care of him. Someone cute like me, for example. When I may not look, I may look quite young, but I'm actually two thousand years old. Shut up. Don't believe me, take this spear. I've killed many manakeets with it. Okay, and dragon spear as well, nice. Nice. Almost cat that speed. So now it's just that village down there, a house, a house, and a village. Okay. There's only one church. There's nothing in those. I thought there'd be like a secret in one of those or something. No, it seems like it's there's no no secret. Get out of here, Fimblefet. Oh, is Fimblefet are super effective against yeah, against dragons. Base. Get on here. Has I have been reborn in Pyrian's flames? Now it's time to punish these heretics. Okay, now it's a bunch of fucking. Ooh, a lot of enemies. Damn. Looks like we have to kill her again. 
I have to, yeah, it seems like I have to kill her quite a, quite a lot. Now you guys gotta hurry up. And on visitor there. Dawn's going to, and then... Nice crit. Okay, get the fuck out. Eh. Okay, about what I expected. Okay, so now let's see. Oh, I have no choice but to go here. That sword master is kind of scary if I can't. Uh, it's kind of scary with the fucking killing edge there. Thank, thank Lord Perrin, you've arrived. I've heard bandits are coming. Whenever there's internal strife, those human marauders rejoice. Please take these magical boots, they. May they carry it in the uh, boots? Help us stabilize the country. Boots, finally! HP res. Oh, I just realized. Oh, fuck. Oh, I'm gonna lose. Nope, never mind. No, no this is in range. Yeah, fuck you. You guys gotta, you gotta get closer so you can fucking start healing. Servant of Fire, come to me. Oh, stupid fucking fire spirits, man. Yeah. Damn, no fucking crit got Oh shit. Okay. Uh uh, at least you can't fucking get destroyed like that easily. Okay. Ah, fuck. I don't know if, uh... Okay, no. Only one of them can reach. Okay, good. Actually, uh... Runa, you kind of... Just gonna stay up here to get this. Adrian is one of the highest ranking military generals in all of Teemite. He served our old king faithfully for hundreds of years. From to plot a coup against the throne upon the king's death, can no one be trusted anymore? So now it's just that house, that house, and the village, and that one village there. And just in case, yeah, there you go. Now no one can attack the uh, function of that one can. They couldn't even reach anyway, so. Okay, out. More dragons are on their way. Okay, still no fucking... Still no f fucking stealables. Most of the military and nobles are sided with Prince Elrodon. Still Tindaris is beloved by the commoners and the poor. There are many who hope that you'll win this battle. You may not look like it, but King Tindaris has a gentle heart. He helped out my family once and gave us gave us food and shelter. I'll never forget his love. Please take this, this gift. Help Tindaris fly to victory. 
Oh, angelic robe based. I'm old. I'm old. Half blood is by half blood standards. I'll see my 20th birthday soon. Even, but even that is considered young for a full blooded dragon. Aqua, I wouldn't give for a drop of pure draconic blood. I don't know about getting that. Okay, I'm almost at S rank. I gotta focus on that a little bit. Hey, cap skill. Oh, they didn't realize. Get you over here, and then... Get you down here. Can... No, 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 those guys can even come close to reaching. Okay, you can one round, but... The chance you will get fucked, so, um... The Holy Fire is good against dark magic, so... That's yeah, still fucking... Well, whatever. Oh, God bless it all. That, but that Buster's men are here again. Ah, fuck, I wish I could have visited, th visited this with Dawn, so I can see if my... Th well, I, I actually kind of already know because of Clocks commenting on uh, one of my... On like episode 7, is they dropped the plot line of him. Well, yeah, I was, I was definitely right about him being an ancestor. Oh, God bless it, all that Buster's men are here again. These strange hooligans, oh, follow me around. Can't just divine take a rest in, at his vacation houses alone. Butler, jeez, kick these ruffians out and get my tea. Yes, Master Ferdinand. Uh. Uh, fucker. Give me the power to smite my foes from afar. Call upon your mightiest blessing, a fiery meteor. Watch out, Ash is channeling a spell. Still don't have it, but I'll actually probably be able to defeat you before you get it equipped. Get this fucking stupid spirit out of here. Here and then get out of here. Okay, I think everything's good now. Yeah. I don't know how many times I have to kill her, but hopefully it's not too many times. Here knows answer my prayers. Fire shall rain from the sky, and then I'm uh, about to summon a meteor, but it will not matter in the slightest. Oh shit, you're running out of weapons. Start healing on my guys soon. What am I doing? I'm just healing the fucking forts. Anyway, time to get fucked. Unless you just fucking decide not to. Whatever. Yeah, strike me down. Pyrrhon watches over me. Skill, damn it. We tap skill now, at least. I don't know where she's gonna pop in next. It's the only annoying part of this mission, looks like. Just. Oh, wow, nice. If you strike me down, I should become more powerful than you can possibly imagine. It's turning into a game of cat and mouse. Oh, yeah, it is. Yeah, there's actually strong enemies here. Ooh, okay. Uh, 
Okay, perfect. Now there's no issues. Yeah. Get your ass up here, get your ass up here, get your ass up here. So get you some fucking weapons. Zero damage because you're based, and six damage from these guys. I love you, Runa. Servant of Fire, come to me. Yeah, yeah same shit. Okay, almost there to C rank, and then there I can easily just continue ranking it up more and more and more because barrier. I just realized I fucking well I mean she's gonna attack you so it's perfect where's she gonna spawn next it's been so far just been in the lava pool so here here and here oh so it's probably gonna be like here next yeah, I think I think I figured out I don't know if it's set. I don't know if it's actually like a set path to go through, but I mean... Seems like also no killing edge. I guess maybe I have too much luck or something. So wow, how come you did damage to me that time? Yeah, more dragons are on their way. Well, that's something for my girl Dawn to deal with, like always. Damn, I thought that would kill. Ooh, that's way too fucking risky. Oh, god damn. So, wow, you're just getting the kills all the damn time now. You know, you fight with such conviction, but I will not lose faith. Oh, did you get that S yeah, double S rank based? Also strength. Nice. 20 fucking strength. You almost have as much fucking strength as Jaira. Which I am very surprised about. Can't bring you guys up here because I know for damn sure that it's gonna be next spawn point. Hopefully it's like the last one, fuck. Strike me down if this continues, I'll be. No, no, I will not lose faith. Period. Grant me. Period. Pyreon. 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 Whatever. Grant me strength. How many, do you, how many times do you have to strike down that uh, this clown? Whatever. I don't know what it said, but the failure was a good thing. I should still have beaten, still have beaten these foreigners. I guess I'll have to get my claws dirty. Oh, I'm putting my tail on the line. Okay, so can anyone talk to that girl? Nope. So she's just the mini boss, and yeah, she's pretty cool. Let's 
see. Uh, there you go, C rank. Push you down here. Get you the fuck away from there. And get you closer. I oh, know it's too risky right there, so I'll just put you here. And yeah, you guys are getting fucked. That's my girl. Look at you. Thank God no Luna. Thank God no Luna. Oh, she do you even have Luna? Definitely do. Nice double. Okay, Silver Sword, that's something. I didn't bother to actually fucking check their weapons. Should have. Anyway, you're dead. Oh, uh, no flame lance, whoops. You're about to die. Peg if you must. That's Luna. That's a fuck ton of damage, but you're dead. Damn, got too careless. There you go, there's the elixir gone. First burn low, I need a moment to gather my strength and pray. She's just gonna get fucked instantly, so it doesn't matter. Oh fuck, I just realized. I'll bring you down here. Actually, not that it fucking mattered here. And now it's for odd too. Speed. You know, these guys don't have Luna, okay. Thank God. Just the boss that had, the, just the mini boss that had Luna. Stuff so I can just spam it every single fucking turn. Oh, so my, only my flyers can get there. Ooh, ouchie. Oh, yes, look, Barons, once again, I heard my prayers. Now you will all die. Not quite. One more turn. Okay, so I gotta hurry the fuck up. Best way to do with that, to deal with this, is use you. Oh, you missed both times. Shit. Shit, I meant to heal. She, what I'll do now is take this killer lens. Shove it out of the fucking way. Give you that goddamn barrier staff. And mend up. Oh, 
Okay, well at least it's like the end of the map right now. Okay, yep. Yeah, you just want to keep on missing. 67% hit, I know, but I like, guess four attacks from the surface of fire come to me. Okay, it's still no meteor tome. Dawn can just fucking annihilate you. Which I might just do. Nice, almost cap speed on you. And then I guess I can do that and then end off this map. Hopefully, this is the end. No more of you. Get the fuck out of here. I don't understand. Why can't I beat you? Oh, no. Nope, still one more turn for this shit. Spawn there again. Here, I know I've asked much, but one more blessing is all I need. Please hear my prayers and grant me the strength to smite my foes. Nope. She getting fucked. Oh, is this the fire god won't answer my prayers? Perion, please hear me. Why do you not answer? Oh, look, Perion refused to answer the, uh, the high priestess' call for help. She has fallen out of his favor. We cannot follow her any longer. Everyone retreat. No, what are you doing? Come back. I'm the high priestess of Perion. My word is law. You cannot refuse. Stand and fight, you cowards. And those dragons, f dragon fanatics sure lost their faith quickly. I don't understand. How are you still alive? How can you withstand Perion's judgment? I guess your god is just weak. He has nothing on the divines. What is so special about your stupid religion anyway? Even a novice mage can fling some fireballs around. Jesus, okay. It's full of no punches right now. You dare insult Perion, you will burn for this. Burning me with fire, how original. It's time for you to die, priestess. Don't kill Ash, she is useful a lie. Let's capture and interrogate her. She knows all about Ilradon's plans. Think you can capture me? Don't make me laugh, Jahara. I was born from Perion's ashes, so I, now I shall return to them. You'll never catch me alive. And she kills herself. Great. She, immol she immolated her body. I had a greater will than I ever imagined. I guess I, under I underestimated her religious zeal. At least she won't, be she won't bother us any longer. Ash, you imbecile, why kill yourself for no reason? Such a waste of a perfectly good life. Commander Miriam, what are you doing? Thought you would choose to run away. Run away? To where? I've already failed Il Adrian and Il Ilrodon. There's no place left for me and Teamite. I like having a place. Your meaning? Isn't it obvious? I might as well join your co- Oh, okay. Wasn't expecting that. What? You're turning against Ilrodon? But why? Aren't you his best general? Ilrodon, Tendaris, what does it matter who I follow? I'm a pragmatist. I can see the writing on the wall. Assuming you make it to him in time, Tendaris will win. But can we trust someone who switches sides so easily? You might be planning to stab me and Jaka in the back. Oh please, you know me better than that. I'm too cowardly to backstab my bosses. Isn't that what you're doing to Lord Adrian right now? Nope, this is an honorable change of allegiance. I'm going to face him all beside you, head to head. Backstab would be stabbing someone from behind, yes? Completely different thing. I... Why does that make so much sense? You have your own twisted logic. Commander Miriam, fine, you may join us, but try not to anger Jaka. He detests betrayals. If you lose, don't be surprised when I call back to Adrian. I don't like working for losers. Jahara. It'll be fine, she's no she's more reliable than you'd expect. If you say so. I somehow I doubt that. I mean her stats were actually pretty decent, so. So 
So where do we go from here? Castle Dr Drake Spire is only a few days travel away. If we move quickly, we might be able to make it in time. Do you think Zendara is still alive? If, we're not, if, we were, if you were not, we would know already. Though I don't think he has long left. Let's not waste any time. Lead the way, Jihara. Andron, one of the Lightbringer Shrines. Oh, there's Mortimer again. Oh, he has a new design. Nice. He got new clothes. He got the King Drip. And he's gonna get a flashback too. And here we are, the Luminous Shrine, the more first one ever built in Andron. The largest of the holy temples. It's so big. It must have taken years to build. Not at all. Sir Joseph's children built Lumina in only a month. It's amazing. How could they do such a thing? The Lightbringers are capable of magnificent feats of architecture. Architecture. They have access to technology and magic we can only dream of. And do they no longer have that? Our Aurora is, a new, is known by their people as the New World. Only the Old Continent holds the true Lightbringer magic. Aurora's branch can no longer build more like Lumina. I don't know why, but that makes me sad. Nice well, Morty. Thank you for taking me, your mother. I really enjoy our trips together. Of course, but please don't tell your father about this. You know how he acts when it comes to the Lightbringers. You want me to lie to father? Mother and his son are allowed to have their secrets, are they not? Yes, I suppose so. Nephew, apologies for interrupting your, t your time of well-earned leisure. There's been a development with the Lord of Lances. It's fine, I was only reminiscing. What happened, ha Uncle Galahad? The spies report that Jaka and his men have entered Timayat. This is the first we've heard from them in over six months. So they have finally decided to come out of their exile. What do their actions suggest? I guess is that they are getting involved in the Tim Timaitan civil war. There's a big dispute going on over the throne between the brothers. If Jaka and his men were to tip the scales of that war, they would gain a powerful ally in King Tendaris. We should intervene. Just give me the word and I'll gather an invasion force. I'll lead the charge into Team Might myself and crush those rebel insects. No, I think not, Galahad. We will not get involved. After the work he did convincing Illuridan to attack his brother, now you hang him out to dry? Doesn't make sense. Doesn't make much sense to me. Illuridan has served his purpose. He helped me take the throne. Other than that, I have no love for the little rodent. Pandarus is a more intelligent dragon than his brother. If I had to choose one to rule for over 500 years, it would be him. I see, I was looking out for the greater picture, ne picture nephew. Is that why you choose to f chose to choose to follow me, uncle? Or could there be another reason lingering, unspoken? I won't lie, Mortimer, I envy your intellect. You did what I failed to do years ago. When Thorgrim fooled me. Mother told me the story. For other people, that's all it is, an amusing story. But for me, it was a defining moment that changed my life. I considered killing Thorgrim in the past, before the deceit. That's why he did it, you know. He hungered for the throne, as did I, but not Robert. Robert was content with a simple life, building a family. He was a lot like Bodyman. Thorgrim told me I could attain great prestige by leading the Steel Knights. What I did not know was that doing so would abdicate my right to rule. Even if Thorgrim and Robert both died, I, can, I, would, I could never guide Andron's path. We and I were both the youngest of our sibling trios, but... Lingering on the past won't change a thing, Uncle. It's better to adapt to the future. Yet here you are, reminiscing of this Lightbringer Shrine. I have no right to speak on matters in which I'm underqualified. Only one of us actually killed his brother and became brothers and became king. Ugh, I can't talk. You're the shining example of what Steel should be. Keep fighting that good fight, Mortimer. I know you will soon lead House Steel to greatness. Even if we throw away our name, it means little. I'm glad to have you at my side, Uncle. Mother always did like your way with words. <laughs> I'll keep Lady Maria's soul in my prayers, boy. House Steel. Yeah, a very interesting conversation there with, with Galahad and Mortimer. And slowly but surely, we're trying to figure out what exactly, like Mortimer is trying to accomplish here by being by leading Andaron technically. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this episode. That chapter was kind of, eh. I mean, there's a gimmick. And that uh, gimmick existed. Would have been interesting if she was actually a bit more challenging. But I guess with the meteor, it's just like, oh, it's a time limit, I don't know. But with how small the map is, it's kind of easy to... 
He got to her quickly. Hey, at least it wasn't Siege Tome Hell, so I'm at least somewhat happy about that. And it, at least it proves to me, hey, Siege Tomes. Actually, I think Boltings existed before. I forgot. No, I think they did. I can't remember. In any case, it's going to be it for this episode. So next time, on Andran, uh, Let's Play Vandaran Saga, we're going to be taking on Chapter 21. I don't know if we're going to be helping out Tindaris right away or if it's going to be another map in between, but I think it's going to be helping out Tindaris. In any case, see you guys next time. Take care.